<rire> ouais, j'ai te voyé tout le long. Je vois, mais moi aussi, je t'ai voyé tout le long. On commence à se faire du souci, mon gars. La partie basse, en fait, j'ai pris un éperon rocheux. Ouais. C'est sympa, tu verras, petit passant mix et tout. Entre les deux gros rochers noirs. Oh. Et puis après l'arrête, elle est hyper longue. Tu montes ouais, un bah sommet, ouais. tu descends, et puis tu remontes jusqu'au sommet. Now we can see that above the line of uh, 7,300, it's a lot of snow, so it's pretty complicated to go up. But summit is not far. This is like 200 more meters to go. Here we can see all the long ridge. And there it's Everest. Et puis quand tu arrives à la liaison de l'arête du col nord, ouais. c'est pas fini hein. Là, il y a encore une belle arête hyper affilée. Euh. And the ridge. It's also not much visibility. So now I'm at Changstest, 7,566 meters and uh, the visibility is very very bad. We cannot see Everest in our face and here all the Rombuk Valley and nothing now. The last part of the ridge was pretty pretty and not much visibility so I hope I hope to have some visibility in the downfield to be a bit safer. Bye! You can receive them here is steep or not. It's pretty close fog. Opa. It's a very, very narrow reach to the summit. And if I start to snow, there we see the reach to the summit behind. Where I come from, our camp is there in the glacier, it's sunny. And here is the reach to the North Pole. <sighs> Let's go down fast now. Now I understand why it was so hard to get up here. Look, there's no up to the knee here in the ridge. And here you can see when you glide with the bat, 
you can use your feet up to accelerate and down to stop up to accelerate, down to stop and you can have also the Isaacs in case it's not enough with the crampons and that's also a good way to pass the Remaya when you have no rope and you have no skis just let light and with the speed you have less chance to fall in so crevas area when you are alone in no skis you can always roll like that to, to make more distribution right or you can always go like that Now back back to the cab with zero visibility. But it has been a good day. We need to take advantage of these days because if not, if we are always waiting for the sun and good conditions, we will stay all the time in the base cab and oh that's so hard. It is nice to just go out and do some small summits around.